Between 1983 and 1987, Zimbabwe's multiple and Midland provinces suffered a genocide that culminated in an estimated 20,000 innocent civilians losing their lives. While talking about the subject is almost a taboo in Zimbabwe, here is a 25-year-old author, Crispin Lowe from Bulawayo, who has dedicated his life to addressing the atrocities. My name is Chris Benningloff. I'm an artist. I also do photography part-time and also I'm an author. Uh, I have written about three books published right now, up to date. And uh, I usually take the issue of Kukurawundi. I chose this particular subject because it is one of the most sacred issues that has never been uh, publicly addressed, especially by maybe artists, journalists, and even the government. So through my writings, I, 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 I strive, I try to, to try and uh, uh, take some issues that were involved with Kukurawundi. As you know that Kukurawundi they lead to the massacre of up to about 20,000 people in this region of Matavele and in Zimbabwe and no prosecution, no trials were done up to date. No one is taken up the blame for, 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 for the killings, for the massacres. Uh, this is a, a different stance. Okay, this is my first book that was called Kuvea. That is called Kuvea actually. It's uh, doing well in the local and international market. It's also available on Amazon. And uh, this is my second book that was launched on the same day with this one. This one is a translation of this one, but in our native language. So this one is just a compilation of poetry, but that addresses many issues that affect the, the region, like marginalization, unemployment, and also the, the issue of Kukurawundi in, in Matewele. Well, uh, I, I'm not really afraid to, to tackle this issue because this issue is factual, it's based on facts, it's based on research, people have researched and brought out documents that talk about Kukura and it's something that happened, it's an event that happened in, in our history. So no one will like, come to me and say that uh, I've misrepresented or I've committed a crime because something that everyone knows. And